In this video, we're going to talk about blending modes. Blending modes are simple in a way that anyone can use them, but powerful that you can create incredibly looking work just by applying any one of the blending modes. We are going to dive straight right in and we see exactly how these blending modes work. When I click toggle switches stroke modes, we now have mode right there. These are all blending modes, okay? This first section of blending modes makes white pixels transparent. The second one makes black pixels transparent. The third one makes gray pixels transparent. And the fourth one shows the difference between the two. So in this case, I'm having footage and I change the blending mode to multiply, which makes white pixels transparent. This is what happens. We now see that this video we had in the background is showing up within the text we had. We use an effect like screen or light and no add. Okay, we're going to choose add. If we choose add, it's going to make the black pixels tra uh, transparent and the white pixels opaque. If I use add, so that's what happens. We now see that it's on the outside wherever we had the black, okay? And now we are going to move it to the next section of blending modes. If you've used overlays before, they normally have a gray background in them. And having that, you can put footage under them and then use the blending mode overlay, okay? In this case, overlay makes gray pixels transparent right there, okay? So I'm going to use blending mode overlay on the gray there, okay? So without the blending mode, it's going to look like that. If we add the blending mode overlay, it's going to look exactly like that. Now we're going to see the difference between pixels, okay? So right now I'm having uh, number nine directly on top and below it is we're having this footage that slides all the way, okay? If I go to the beginning or wherever I am, I'm just going to apply the blending mode difference on this number nine, okay? And we, right now we see that it's nine. But if I keep bringing, letting this footage play back, we are now seeing that it's now showing us the difference between what was originally white and now what's under it, which is black. So, so let's go a little bit into those blending modes that kind of look different. Hue, color, luminosity, stencil, alpha. You can play around with them, but right now I'm going to talk about stencil alpha. So if I have text like, if I have text like stencil, and uh, we're going to align it into the center, now I'm going to pick a background and put it directly in there. If I put it under and I use the blending mode stencil alpha, we now see that the video we originally had, which was that one, that video right there, is directly inside the text if we use stencil alpha. So basically that's how blending modes work. I really hope you've learned something new and um, see you in the next video.